Andre and his friends never wished to see their conception devolve into some kind of esoteric sect, sub-club, or assemblée of éminence grise, behind, above, or before any exclusive society whatever. To all that would listen, they said, do the spiritual work, that is, the ergon, and God will reveal his natural secrets, called the paragon or byproduct, to those who seek. The vault of the adept is, it seems, open to all that see it. The problem of the world's endemic spiritual blindness is no less a problem to us than it was for the true godfather of Rosicrucianism, Philip Theophrastus von Hohenheim, that is to say, Paracelsus. I shall give you what no eye has seen, and what no ear has heard, and what no hand has touched, and what has never occurred to the human mind. The images are manifest to man, but the light in them remains concealed in the image of the light of the Father. He will become manifest, but his image will remain concealed by his light. And so, our building, although 100,000 people had very near seen and be held the same, shall forever remain untouched, undestroyed, and hidden to the wicked world. Thank you.